Hey, it's Andrew with CarCam Central. Did you know your SD card wears out faster than a dash camera? Picking the right SD card can improve durability for not much more money. We tell you what to look for and why Sandus Ultra cards should be avoided. Starting with the storage space, I think the sweet spot for value is 32 gigabytes. It provides three to seven hours of 1080p recording time, which is more than enough for the average driver. If you purchase a smaller card, you pay more money per gigabyte and only save a few dollars. Professional drivers may benefit from larger cards to respond to complaints about their driving with video evidence. These are significantly more expensive and aren't worth it for the typical driver. Next, you want the right speed rating. Too slow and your camera can stop recording. You want to look for either a Class 10 or UHS U1 speed class markings. Both mean a minimum performance of 10 megabytes of data per second written to the SD card. There are faster speeds, but it won't improve the performance of your dash camera. You also want the right NAND type, which is how the memory chip inside your SD card was constructed. Most consumer SD cards use TLC NAND, which is cheaper but less reliable. More expensive cards are MLC, which cost more but have better durability and are the best choice for dash cameras. Durability is important, as dash cameras constantly write videos to the SD card, which permanently damages the memory cells. Cheaper cards have much less capacity to absorb damage and can fail earlier, leaving you without protection. One of my recommended cards is the Transcend Endurance. It uses MLC memory, which Transcend rates for 6,000 hours of 1080p recording on the 32GB card. If we do the math, that means it can override itself the videos over 2,000 times before failing. Let's compare that against the Sandus Ultra. It uses TLC memory, which on average only has 500 write cycles. Comparing the two cards, the Transcend Endurance has 2.5 times more durability per dollar spent. But that's not all. Many premium cards have better wear leveling technology, controllers, and error correction codes, which all help to improve reliability under heavy use. The Sandus Ultra card is speculated to have an especially poor controller, which has compatibility problems with dash cameras. Many users have reported problems and several manufacturers warn people away from the Ultra series. Your warranty is also void if the Ultra is used in a dash cam. Sandisk isn't a bad brand. If the Transcend isn't available, Sandisk High Endurance card is a great pick. It's just not our top recommendation because it's less durable for the same size. They also don't talk about the error correction codes, which is found in their pricier products and on Transcend's Endurance. If you're looking for a 128GB card, the Lexar 633X is a great option. It has a lifetime warranty valid for dash cameras and is made from MLC NAND. When purchasing your SD card, make sure it's from a reputable source. Counterfeit cards are everywhere. They look like the original, but they're slower, they're smaller, or less reliable than the original. Now, don't buy off of eBay, don't buy off of AliExpress, don't buy used. If you purchase from Amazon, you want to make sure your cards are sold directly and not fulfilled through Amazon by an unknown third-party vendor. Amazon's marketplace makes it easy for companies to set a lower price and become the default seller. We went through a lot of information, so here's our recommendations on one page. I personally prefer Transcend's High Endurance as it has optimizations for dash camera use. But this could all be marketing talk as it's difficult to verify claims, which is why Lexar 633X is a great option. It's cheaper and has a better lifetime warranty and speed. Sandus High Endurance has good reviews, but on paper, it's not as good as Transcend. If you're a fan of Sandus, this is a good purchase. I would avoid their Ultra series because of its history of early failures and the loss of your warranty when used in a dash camera. We have more details on the article we wrote on SD cards, such as how Samsung may deny your warranty if their SD cards are used in a dash camera. So that's the end of this guide. Hope you found it useful. If you liked it, please give it a thumbs up. If you want more, please subscribe and thanks for watching.